Hey guys, in this video I'll be installing a catch can in the Jetta. But before we get into that, let's do a quick overview of catch cans and why you may want one. The purpose of a catch can is to separate oil vapors from the air in the PCV system so the oil doesn't end up in the intake. In a port injected engine, the fuel washes it away. But in a direct injected engine, the residue builds up. That's even more of a problem in a direct injected diesel because the oil vapors are mixing with soot in the exhaust from the EGR system. It creates a nasty black residue that will eventually clog up your intake manifold. So yeah, putting a catch can on a direct injected diesel is a good idea. It's also easy to install and fairly inexpensive. I bought this catch can from Amazon. For the Mark IV TDI engine, you want a catch can with 19 millimeter hose fittings. Searching for a BMW catch can will bring up lots of ones with 19 millimeter hose fittings. Okay, let's get started. First, the engine cover needs to come off. Now let's remove the PCV hose. One end has a hose clamp, the other end clips on. If you squeeze the tabs, it'll come loose. Now I'm going to cut the PCV pipe. It'll be used as a hose adapter for the catch can. You could also buy an aftermarket hose adapter if you want. The mounting bracket for the catch can has a tab that needs to be cut off. I originally planned to attach it to the oil filter housing, but that didn't work out. Space is tight in there and hose routing would have been problematic. After cutting the tab, I cleaned up the edges with a file and I reinstalled the bracket onto the catch can. Since I couldn't mount the catch can to the oil filter housing, I decided to attach it to the battery box. The bracket fits into a slot on the side of the battery box. Now let's reinstall the PCV hose that I cut in half. Also I rotated the PCV valve to point the hose connection toward the catch can. The PCV valve has a tab on the bottom that fits a hole in the valve cover. And luckily the valve cover has another hole that I can use. That was convenient. Some people remove the PCV valve and install a 90 degree elbow instead, but my PCV valve is still good, so why bother? Okay, we're almost done. I just need to install the hoses. I bought three feet of vacuum hose from the local auto parts store. It's three quarter inch inside diameter. I test fitted the hose and marked where it needed to be cut. Then I installed the hoses and clamped. Last but not least, I used a Velcro tie to tidy up the hoses. One of them was really close to an engine cover mount. I didn't want the hose rubbing on it. And that's it. Mission accomplished.